Welcome back, Struggle Tours Firewood. I'm getting a log truck delivered. Actually, I'm getting a couple log trucks delivered, but you guys let me know in the comments, is this how you guys like to get your logs delivered? Or do you actually pull them out of the woods yourself? Welcome back to Struck Accord Firewood. I know it's been a while since I posted a video, but now the weather's changing, so we're gonna start getting more of them on. Make a firewood the easy way. 1222 Easton made, up the Wolf Ridge conveyor, right in the IBC totes. Let me show you what I got going on. If you saw the very first video, you'll see that I had all these logs delivered, okay? Now, I've probably cut up a third of them. I have a pile here. And I got a pile back there with all these IB, IBC totes. The reason I'm cutting this on my driveway today, okay, is for the simple fact, I don't know if you can see, but it is muddy as anything. And I'm tired of uh, paying for dirt, grading my own lawn, taking a you know, weekend out and fixing everything. So I'm trying to stay off the lawn the best I can. That, and I don't have to hear the wife. Um, so I had these uh, logs delivered, okay? And as you can see, it's mostly red. And there's some white oak in there too. Um, I asked the guy that was delivering them if he could give me no ash. Now, I love ash. Um, people that burn ash like ash. But ever since this ash beetle came, it's kind of got a, a bad stigma about it. Uh, the wood's still good. Um, I'm going to say probably another two years, it won't be good, but all the ash trees are dead. So, I mean, a lot of times when you get loads delivered, they want to give you a huge ash. I mean, I've cut ash, you've seen on my videos, 35 inches across, um, but they want to give you a huge ash. So when I want this stuff delivered, I told them I want mostly oak and it's all got to be hardwood or I'm not paying for it, obviously. And I'd like it to be 18 inches and under. This way it's manageable for me. And when my kids help me, nobody's getting hernias and anything else. Um, so that's what we got going on right now. Uh, any questions, leave it down in your comment. Let me know uh, what you guys pay for a uh, log load of um, uh, a truck full of logs. Um, I'm pretty sure I've gotten them in the past. I'm gonna get about eight and a half cords, I guess, out of that log truck. And again, uh, we're in Pennsylvania, uh, Bucks County. So I'm gonna say, I think I paid 700, that's tax included, everything, um, for that log load. So it's about $85, $80, something like that, a cord. Um, right now with gas going up, everything's going up. I raised my prices, but I sold a lot of wood this year. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say probably 30 cords of wood I sold. Um, so just keep that in mind. I probably have maybe 10 or 12 cords split, mostly ash. And then I have an emergency seven cords of red oak that's been seasoning for two years. That's, that's my emergency. If I ever run out or I sell everything, I'll go hit that. So um, that's it. Like, subscribe, leave your comments down. Thanks, I appreciate it. Classic. 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 Classic.
I'd like to return to the classic. Yeah, uh, 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 yeah. Can't buy this, super flyness, like a shyness, your highness, this performing, look how long the line is. It's what happened, you make so mostly oak. There's some hickory in there. There is a little maple, but not much. Uh, it's mostly all red oak. There's some white oak and hickory. So this is premium stuff here.